Do you know how we can produce items which glitter as gold or silver? At the end of this lesson, you should be able to State what electrolysis is State what anode, cathode, anion, cation and electrolytes are there are two ways metals can be extracted. Metals below carbon are extracted by using carbon. The other method is by electrolysis. The position of aluminum in the reactivity series tells us that we cannot extract aluminum from aluminum oxide with carbon. Those metals above carbon are extracted by the process of electrolysis. Electrolysis is a reaction which uses electricity to decompose a chemical compound into its constituents. Diagram shows an electrolytic cell. The cell consists of parts that are essential for electrolysis. Carbon is normally used as electrode. Learn in more details about the parts in an electrolytic cell by clicking on the labels. Cathode is the electrode that is connected to the negative terminal of a battery. This is the source of electrical energy. The symbol for battery is illustrated by a long and a short vertical line. The long line indicates the positive terminal, while the short line indicates the negative terminal. Anode is the electrode that is connected to the positive terminal of a battery. Cations are the positively charged ions. It will be attracted to cathode, the negative terminal. Anions are the negatively charged ions. It will be attracted to anode, the positive terminal. An electrolyte is a substance in the form of an aqueous solution dissolved in water or molten that can conduct electricity. Most of the electrolytes are composed of two or more different elements. This combination will give the electrolyte the different charge ions needed to accept or release electrons. Electrolytes are composed of metal and non-metal elements. Electrolysis can occur when there is an electric source and electrolyte. Observe the bulb when the carbon electrodes are immersed in the three solutions. Predict in which beaker the bulb will light up. Is your prediction correct? What can you say about the existence of ions in the beakers? Salt solution and vinegar contains ions, while sugar solution has no ions but only molecules. From the information, which solutions are electrolytes? Vinegar and salt solution are electrolyte. How can you relate electrolytes and ions? 
Electrolytes are ionic compounds that conduct electricity in the molten state or in aqueous solution. Therefore, the bulb lights up in vinegar and salt solution. Observe the electrolytic cell. The solution is sodium chloride. Can you identify the anode and cathode? Give a reason for your choice. X is cathode because it is connected to the negative terminal of the battery. Y is anode because it is connected to the positive terminal of the battery. Name the cation and anion in sodium chloride solution. State your reason for the answer. Sodium ion and hydrogen ion are the cation because they are positively charged. Chloride ion and hydroxide ion are the anion because they are negatively charged. Diagram shows an electrolytic cell. Drag and drop to label the diagram. Your answer is correct. 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 Click table 1 to define each label. Your answer is correct. Your answer is correct. That's not right. Please try again. Your answer is correct. Your answer is correct. Your answer is correct. Your answer is correct. Diagram shows six words that are related to an electrolytic cell. The letters are scrambled. Rearrange the words to match the description of an electrolytic cell.
energy changes that occur during electrolysis is A. Chemical energy to light energy B. Light energy to chemical energy C. Chemical energy to electrical energy D. Electrical energy to chemical energy Your answer is correct. In an electrolytic cell, anode is the electrode connected to the A. Ammeter B. Voltmeter C. Positive terminal of the battery D. Negative terminal of the battery Your answer is correct. Which statement is correct about the electrolyte of molten lead to bromide? A. Lead ions are the anions. B. Electrolysis does not occur. C. Bromide ions are the anion. D. Bromide ions are the cation. Your answer is correct. Which of the following is an electrolyte? A. Sugar solution B. Solid sodium chloride C. Solid aluminium oxide D. Copper II sulfate solution Your answer is correct. Which of the following are not cations? A. Bromide ions B. Potassium ions C. Magnesium ions D. Aluminium ions Your answer is correct. In this lesson, you have learned about electrolysis and the electrolytic cell. Reaction which uses electricity to decompose a chemical compound in its electrolyte into its constituents. See what you have learned by pointing to the labeled parts. It is the electrode that is connected to the negative terminal. It is the electrode that is connected to the positive terminal. Substance in the liquid state that is molten or solution that can conduct electricity. These are the positive ions. Substance in the liquid state that is molten or solution that can conduct electricity. These are the negative ions. Drinks such as isotonic drinks have a large amount of glucose which can provide energy. The drinks are commonly sold to the public. Click the info button to learn more about isotonic drinks. Isotonic drinks containing sodium and potassium salts are used to replenish the body's water and electrolyte levels after dehydration caused by exercise diaphoresis, diarrhea, vomiting, or starvation. Isotonic drinks contain very high levels of sugar, therefore they are not recommended for regular use by children. Isotonic drinks can be homemade by using the correct proportions of sugar, salt, and water.